Designing, engineering, and installing complete comfort systems. A good neighbor heating and cooling. And for a limited time, take advantage of a furnace and central air conditioning package. Installed for only $56 a month. Call a good neighbor heating and cooling for a tune-up and inspect your system today. You could see a change in your energy bill. The grill season is upon us. Check out the great selection of grills and grilling accessories, including sauces and rubs. A good neighbor heating and cooling since 1919. Ready to serve 24-7. Hi, Casey Hendrickson here with Michiana's Morning News on 95.3 MNC. A lot of people have been asking me what I think about Paul Ryan being tapped for VP with Mitt Romney's campaign. Look, it's a good pick. It could be worse. It could be a lot better, as with any candidate would be. But here's the thing. My opinion really doesn't matter all that much. What does matter is what the Democrats think. I know, it seems a little weird. It's a Republican guy, but we're talking about the Democrats. Well, Juan Williams seems to think this is a slam dunk. Juan Williams says, hey... Might as well just hand the election to uh, Barack Obama right now. We've heard that all over the place. In fact, NBC ran with it. I saw a story on CBS run with it. A lot of people are debating it on CNN and even Fox News. So is it really a slam dunk? I don't know. There's a couple of problems. Democrats are saying it's his budget and how seniors receive it that could be the biggest problem, except that when polled, seniors actually prefer ryan's budget to anybody else's they have wide support for his budget because his budget unlike the president's obamacare policy i know budget obamacare is a different thing don't nitpick in the comments please look it cut it over 700 billion dollars ryan's doesn't do that ryan's actually saves it doesn't change anything for current seniors or soon to retire seniors but my generation we have some options that's his plan and then there's something else too Democrats are trying to put on a brave face. They're trying to tell you that they're happy about this pick. Something very interesting happened in the polling. Now, I'm not talking about let's go out and talk to a 1,000 likely voters and see where they stand on this thing so we can go and poll out the election. I'm talking about the electoral votes, state by state, where things stand now. Since Paul Ryan was announced, for the first time in this election, Mitt Romney's the projected winner, actually by a pretty sizable margin. Right now, he has, according to polling, which again could change, right now he's got a 260 to 221 lead in electoral votes with only 57 up for grabs. Most of the countries turned red, and they raised $3.5 million in the first day after Paul Ryan's been announced. Make no mistake, Democrats are worried about this one. I'm your host of Michiana's Morning News on News Talk 95.3, Michiana's News Channel.